Look at this. We've just found the lions, everyone, the ones that we said we were looking for. And it is a big male that I can see here. And just off to the right is a female lying in the grass. Now, I'm not sure if they are the only lions here. There might be more. Um, I've had a quick look around, but as you can see, the grass is very, very long at the moment, and they are well hidden. Now, fortunately for us, these lions did make a kill last night. They managed to kill a zebra, and, but it looks like they've been feeding for most of the morning, and now, with it being so very hot, they're resting in the shade and trying to basically conserve their energy. And later, they'll most likely go and feed. They did look like there was still some of the zebra left, and they'll go and feed a little bit later. What I'll try to do is, just now, I'll move around and try to show you some of that carcass that is left of the zebra. Um, but these lions, you can see, they're panting heavily. Look at that male, especially. Um, see how he's, he's breathing quite heavily, he's panting. Now the reason for that is he is hot and he's got a full belly, so they breathe very heavily. You can actually see how swollen that belly is. He's managed to feed on a lot of zebra meat. Oh, Lana, now the hottest temperature on record in this area, I would imagine it's about 50 degrees Celsius, somewhere around there, 52 degrees Celsius. Now that's probably about 115 or 120 degrees uh, Fahrenheit, so somewhere around there for this part of South Africa, which is very, very hot. This afternoon's not too bad. Um, I think it's probably about 28 degrees Celsius. Uh, so it's, 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 about, it's 26 degrees Celsius and that's 78 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's not too hot. It does get much warmer but you need to remember everyone we are moving into our winter now so this is autumn for us so the temperatures are starting to cool down and um, which is great so we're going to start experiencing much cooler temperatures now i'm going to try and reposition the vehicle see if there aren't any other lines lying around let's go back to jamie and her beautiful elephant <laughs> 